Hello and welcome back to Everything Gaming. I hope that you are all staying safe. And in today's video, we are going to be doing another Forzathon guide for this week's Forzathon, which is called Crash and Splash. And it wants you to own and drive any extreme off-road vehicle. Now, if you filter the vehicles you've got, you'll see that you've got probably quite a decent selection as there's quite a few of them in the game, to be honest. A lot of weird and wacky ones. But I'm going to play it safe and go with the Bowler EXRS. Now this is one that is easily accessible to everyone. Uh, I'm sure that most of you have one anyway. And of course, I am going to be using a tune for this one. Now I'm going to be using the S1 class tune. And you can download it off my storefront. It's called Fastest S1. And it is pretty quick. It's got 1,351 brake horsepower. But if you want something a little slower with literally half of that, I've also got an A class tune for you guys to use if you want to do so. Now, the first challenge here wants you to complete five cross-country series events. So for this, I went over to the Ambleside Rush cross-country. Now, I'm sure you know what's coming here. It is a nice, quick route for you. Now, it's called Quick and Easy, and the share code is 6223882275. And all you have to do is type that in, and this race will come up. And then all you have to do is win the race five times. Now, I'm sure if you watch my videos before, you'll know that I use this one quite often in any sort of challenge like this because I send the AI off on their own little race, which just leaves you a nice straight cruise to the finish line. And then after this, all you have to do is win them four more times. Uh, the second challenge wants you to get two star score or more on any speed zone. Now, as I'm sure you know as well, I have a favoured speed zone and it's the forest green one. So two stars around here is only 75 mile an hour and three stars is 90 mile an hour. And it is definitely the easiest speed zone in the game. And it's definitely easy, easily doable um, in the Bowler EXRS. Now, you can just cruise it at 100 mile an hour if you want, instead of going flat out and having to slam on the anchors for the corners. Or you can just go full whack, it doesn't matter. But I can pretty much guarantee you will get three stars and complete the second challenge nice and easily there. Not too difficult at all. Now the final challenge just wants you to earn 10 ultimate wreckage skills in your extreme off-road vehicle. Now of course an ultimate wreckage skill is where you get four wreckage skills in quick succession. As per usual with most sort of skills, uh, it goes all the way up through sort of awesome and stuff to ultimate. And to do this, I went over to the Greendale Airstrip. Now, there are loads of places that you can get wreckage skills across the map because a wreckage skill is just smashing into stuff. But the good thing about Greendale Airstrip is there is a ton of stuff to smash into and a massive variety from sort of landscaping things like trees and bushes to lampposts, cones, bins, fences, everything you can think of, you can smash into at the airstrip. And it is very, very easy to get an ultimate wreckage skill. As you can see here, I'm just going through various clips where I've got them. It took me probably about 10 minutes or so to get all 10 of them, which is actually pretty good, uh, all things considered. But like I said, all you have to do is basically get four wreckage skills in quick succession. So it goes up from wreckage to great wreckage to awesome wreckage to ultimate wreckage. And then you have to just get 10 of them and you will have completed the final challenge there. Now, I hope that this video helped everyone out. Uh, if you are new to the channel, I very much appreciate if you could subscribe for more content just like this. And if it did help you out, don't forget to drop a like. If you are struggling with anything, please say so down below in the comments and I will respond and help you out as best as I can. But apart from that, folks, I want to wish you all the best. Take care and stay safe.